If you're on the latest version of Final Cut Pro, which is 10.6.7 at the time of filming, you can use the brand new color adjustments effect. But am I the only one who thinks Apple could have done better? Don't get me wrong, the color adjustments effect is a huge step towards simplifying color correction and color grading for beginners. But not only beginners, I think hybrid shooters who are doing photography and videography will benefit from that as well. There's one plugin that I think can do much better. Enter basic controls. A clean user interface and everything you need in one place. dive into this plugin, I want to encourage you to learn the proper tools for color grading video. But if you want to get stuff done at the moment, you don't want to spend time relearning and re-establishing your workflows. So this plugin might be something for you. Let's have a look at it. As you can see, there are many similarities to Lightroom, for example, changing the treatment from color to black and white. We can do that here. And this is no coincidence, but we will get to this in a little bit. First, let's color correct this shot. I think I will increase the overall exposure, something like three would do the trick. Then I think I can pump the contrast just a tad. I will bring back the highlights. And I think I have to counter the whites as well. Yeah, something like that. Then the blacks look fairly okay. I think I can push them just a little bit further. Yeah, something like this. And as you can see, the whole clip is sitting somewhere near the green and blue area. So let's run away from that just a touch, I think. I can push in a little bit more magenta and a little bit more warmth. So something like this. Let's have a look at the before and after. This is before, this is after. And just like that, we did a basic color correction in less than two minutes. Again, in the long run, I would recommend learning the proper color grading tools. If you want to do so, you came to the right channel. But if you're just starting out or you just want to ease the path from photography to videography, feel free to pick up this plugin. It's linked in the video description below. 